Good morning. Uh, Melissa's over there making me bacon. So I'm at the organized chaos shop right now and I just bought this spray stuff and I'm trying to lubricate all my saws and it's not working out for me. This stuff is dripping everywhere. I got it all over the floor, all over my saws and I do not know what's going on here. Whew, cold. So yeah, I'm at the organized chaos shop today. Hands still black. It's gonna take a few more washes before that comes up. I got a few projects I'm working on today. Uh, some of which I won't be able to show you guys yet. Uh, one of them is that for March break program, we normally make get the students to make a bunch of projects that we give away at our barbecue in September. Um, March break didn't happen because of life. Um, and so I'm gonna make a bunch of projects to give away. That's one thing I'm doing today. The other thing I'm doing today is preparing the next project for students to work on. Pre preparing the project, preparing the video, and that's gonna be a planner box. So we're gonna get at that. Something's wrong with the planner. It keeps blowing breakers. Well, that ruins a lot of my plans for today. on the phone with one of our auto mentors who also does the repairs in our carpentry shop on different things and so he wants uh, the pastor under here on the planer once went and he threw this uh, uh, aftermarket one in and he's just wondering if the wires are loose and so we're gonna we're gonna test that I've already taken the panel off and stuff like that so I'm just gonna uh, check all the wires out and hopefully that's our problem Just wiggled the wires and started the planer, and it's running, so that's a good sign. Um, I'm going to run a piece through and see what happens. That was a win, so I'm going to put all the covers back on, call Randy, thank him, and get working on this soon. So I just did a bunch of those things that I told you I wouldn't be able to tell you about at the moment. So we're quite a few hours later and we're getting back to put the planer back together and keep it going. finger so it's touching the board and our pencil wrote about center then we're gonna move there we go a planter box I've decided that that project for the students is too much cutting by hand the planter box I just did um, and so I'm going to make about half the cuts for them right here which will take me not much time at all because I have the better setup. Well 
Well, I didn't get to making those card holders, but we did get uh, the materials cleaned up and ready for uh, a planter box, which is the next thing students are going to be building. Um, so I've been getting, if in case you didn't know, I've been getting projects prepared, doing some videos uh, on how to uh, build these projects for some of the organized chaos students because they can't be at the shop right now, obviously. And so uh, that's one thing I've been doing for them and putting the materials and the tools out so they can do it at home as well as putting the video up for them. And so that's one of the things I did today was prep a whole bunch of those for all the students that want them. And yeah, you saw some of the rest. So I'm sure your dinner's gonna come soon. What do you think? <laughs>